An 82-year-old woman in Fairfield, the victim of an early morning home invasion robbery. She tells us she caught the man rummaging through her garage before he barged into her home, pistol whipped her, and handcuffed her to a chair. Crown Force Philippe Jagal is live tonight at police headquarters in Fairfield with this woman's terrifying tale. Philippe. Yes, Pam. Pat Seehausen turns 83 this December and says this is one of the most frightening encounters of her life, but she says she's thankful to be alive and to be able to share it with us. He hit me back, back in my head, Can I and, and I said, uh, you know, he just hit me, I would say, around here. It did not knock me out, but it knocked me to the ground. Having already had breakfast, showered, and dressed, Pat Seehausen says she had the garage door cracked open to let some fresh air inside her home on Dahlia Street and went to open it up all the way because she was expecting her care provider to show up, but instead found the burglar inside her garage. Before I could get to the phone, he kicked the door in and he hit me with something. Police say that object was a handgun. He did threaten me, but he said he wouldn't harm me if I just behaved. He had handcuffed me to a chair. No, then Pat says that. he ransacked the house for about a half hour before the nurse showed up at around 8.30 in the morning and called 911. But by that time, Pat says the man ran off through the back door. It seemed surreal. It, did, it didn't seem like it was actually happening. It was like watching a television show that, oh, good ending, you know, but it was happening to me. Now I'm really shook up and uh, I'm going to take sleeping pills wherever I sleep tonight. Pat was checked out at a hospital afterwards, but she says she's okay. Unfortunately, she wasn't able to provide much of a description of the burglar to police because she says the man covered up his face, wore a dark hoodie and gloves. Live in Fairfield tonight, Philippe Chagall, Cron 4 News.